Hello everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the part of the world where you are today. I trust you're doing good. Today we are going to make some declarations concerning our life and our destiny. And I encourage you to say it with the all of your heart and with your faith, believing that the Lord will bring whatever you profess with your mouth to pass in Jesus' name. Just like in medicine, when we give a medication, Sometimes we can give it for five days. Sometimes you can give it for a week or even more than that, especially when you're dealing with some serious infections. The same way with the word of the Lord. When you declare it, don't stop declaring it. Don't let it stop at one time. Continue to declare it again and again, again and again, as many times as you need to. Make it your drug. Chant it. Make it your daily declaration. And I pray the Lord will help us as we do so in Jesus' name. Amen. Declare with me. I cannot die because my life is hidden in Christ Jesus. I declare I am not a failure because I am above only and not beneath. And I am the head and not the tail. I cannot be at the end of the class because the Lord has made me the head. I may fail at this attempt, but I know that I will surely succeed because no power can keep me down. I cannot fall because I am held by the mighty hand of the Lord and is keeping me firmly rooted and secured in him. I declare that my feet are planted on the rock of ages, Jesus Christ. So I remain steadfast, even in the face of strong winds, storms, and floods in the name of Jesus. I am not sick. Sickness cannot thrive in my body because Jesus Christ has borne my sickness, pain, and shame. He was beaten for my healing and bruised for my iniquities. Hallelujah. I am not depressed. I cannot be dejected because I have the joy of the Lord flowing through my heart and I rejoice in him evermore. I am not cursed. I do not carry the curse of generations before me. I am not living under the curse of the law because Jesus Christ was hung to pay the penalty for my curse. Jesus has taken the curse for me. When he hung on the cross of Calvary, because it was written, Cause is he that hangs on the cross. So every cause has been broken. Cause of barrenness, cause of failure, cause of delay is broken by his blood. And I declare, I do not have bad luck. Because the presence of the Lord is always with me. And his goodness and his mercy follows me all the days of my life wherever I go. I am not poor. I am not in lack because I have my God, Jehovah Jiri, the great provider as my God. I have more than enough. My God provides exceedingly and abundantly for all my needs, even before I ask or even before I know I will have a need of it. Oh, what a privilege. I am the pampered daughter of the Most High. Do not envy me because I have a God that daily loads me with benefits. I am a benefit girl. I am fearless and courageous to face any challenge and difficulties that may come across my way. Because he that is in me is greater and mightier than he that is in the world. He does not fail nor change. Hallelujah. I am a work in progress and a wonder to the world because I am wonderfully and marvelously created in the likeness and image of the Lord Most High. Do not look down on me. The Lord has created me beautifully and perfectly to bring forth his own glory and nobody can pull me down. So no one can make jest of my look and my stature. I am perfect the way the Lord has created me to be. I declare that I am who I am by the grace and the mercy of the Lord that is working for me. 
I do not have a power of my own, but I rely on the Lord Most High to help me through every situation I find myself. I declare that the peace of the Lord is upon me and my household. No chaos, no storm will pull us down in the name of Jesus. I always have a happy countenance because my trust is in the Lord and not in my power or my intellect. I am coming back with great testimonies of God's wonder in my life. So watch out. You have not seen anything. Greater wonders and testimonies are still coming from my life and family by the hand of the Lord. Hallelujah. And keep declaring till you see the manifestations of this declaration in your life and family. Amen.